We went from shop to shop to shop, and I started my apprenticeship in 1972, and it, and it can lead to great things. <laughs> if you notice inside the shop, there is no rock and roll music. There is no pictures of ladies on the walls. There is no hooting and hollering. We don't run a facility like this, and that's why we stay very busy. When customers come out, they expect to see people working. They expect to see their jobs moving. On all of these machines, seven of them working. The nice thing about working in a shop, I don't care if it's in the CAD, the CAM, on the floor, you'll you'll never be without a job. When the recession hit, my guys were working overtime, so were the ladies. So if you're in this type of a trade, we, we can't get enough of you kids in the trade. That's the problem. Uh, to make a lot of money, guys out there make easily 100000 plus a year. And jobs like that are pretty hard to come by. And the key is how hard you work, how hard you want to go after it, but it can be done. So. Um, a mold floor, what it does is it how the plastic is injected in here. So what we do is we do a mold flow and it shows you the progression, shows you the pressures, it shows you the time, and then it'll also show you where you might have a problem. Um, we have teamed up with Ford, General Motors, and Chrysler for 13 schools in the area to get the kids involved. Kia, we do work for Kia, Honda, that's a Honda job right there. Most of our work is for GM and Chrysler though. It's most of our work. This part right here, we call it the flapper. It uh, it goes on an F-150. This is a unique part because it's made with two different materials. This is a vulcanized rubber, and then this is a, a glass reinforced nylon. consider manufacturing until after visiting the factories. The tour really opened my eyes for my future career choices. Manufacturing day was probably one of the best days of the year I've had so far. It really opened my eyes to a lot of the capabilities and job opportunities that I can have in the future, so I think that's definitely something that I'd like to do in the future. Go Bulldogs!